Welcome back. This is going to be my daily forecast for 29th of September 2020. And we were looking at the US dollar, US indexes, the S&P 500, Dow Jones and the Nasdaq. And uh, if you'd like to support our channel, you're welcome to subscribe, hit the bell button and the like button and to see our newest videos. So um, the market is quite green today. We have had we basically opened higher, we gapped higher, but we have run into resistance at the 50 moving average. Um, at this point, it is only the 50 moving average that is um, is in the way from uh, from uh, retesting these highs of 3,400. Um, the lows of the, in this market is 3,200. Um, and the, the main reason why we have this... Uh, Increase in the market is because the US dollar is uh, depreciating again. Whether or not it's just one day or it will continue depreciating, um, that is to be seen. But technical indicators for the daily chart are very positive for the S&P 500 at the moment. We can see the MACD uh, is about to cross the signal line probably tomorrow or Wednesday, uh, indicating bullish momentum. Uh, RSI is looking really bullish and the same goes for the stochastic. Um, yes, at the moment we are giving some of the gains back. We'll probably, we're not at the end of this session, so we'll probably retest it several times. Um, if we have a closing above uh, the 50 moving average and then uh, stop above the 50 moving average on Tuesday, the session that is a really good sign that this market is uh, ready to go higher. However, just above here we have the 3,400 level, which will be additional resistance uh, for this market. Lows are 2,000, 3,400, and the 100 moving average is this green line here. If that breaks, we'll go all the way down to the 200 moving average, which is around uh, 3,100. So if you look at Dow Jones, there. So we have broken through the 50 moving average in the Dow Jones, but we have given some of the gains back. If we break through and uh, basically stop above the 50 moving average, that is a really good sign. Um, uh, the MACD is looking really good. We're about to cross the signal line to probably tomorrow. And the RSI is also looking really bullish. If we have another green candlestick above the 50 moving average in tomorrow's session, then that is a sign that we'll go much higher from here. The lows are, are 26,500. Um, there is just a lot of support under here. Both the 100, the 300 and 200 moving average are uh, just underneath there. Then they will be massive support. Again, also historical support at this level of uh, around uh, 26,000. So if you look at the NASDAQ, we are at this moment trading above the uh, 50 moving average. Everything is pointing to the, this market going significantly higher from here. If we were to break down through the 50 moving average, then we'll then we'll probably go back to the, uh, towards the 100 moving average. But at this point, um, technical indicators, everything is basically pointing to higher levels. The next major resistant is going to be this area here of uh, 11,500. And after that, we will go to the all time highs. This will probably take uh, several uh, weeks, maybe months in order to, uh, to go higher from here but everything is looking fantastic for the, and the, uh, for the NASDAQ at this point. So hope you find this video helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by subscribing, hit the bell button, the like button and the like button and um, good luck and happy trading.